What's up, Warriors of Jagoku? We are playing some Dynasty Warriors 3, and normally I'd be doing a stage right now, but I forgot all of my save data has been gone because of, you know, losing memory cards, because memory cards is an amazing thing. And this was before Cloud Storage, so when you lose something, you have to start all over. So I ended up having to do that, and I don't really have much for Zhao Yun right now. So instead, what we're going to be doing, so we can show off all his moves and the evolution of him, we're going to be doing a challenge mode instead, and we're going to be playing with the boy Zhao Yun. That's pretty much all there is to that. And this is the continuation of evolution of the warrior for Zhao Yun. Uh, and it's time to see how much this man has evolved in one game. So pretty much in my opinion with this game, it was as soon as it wants to load, uh, it, this game was definitely a much more, um, oh, before when I was, uh, practicing this. Ooh, the problem is you can get stunned very easily in this game. And you gotta work with the camera, otherwise it won't work with you. So I'm gonna try to see how long we can last here instead. If anything, I'll probably just make it a couple, not, not super short, but, like, do, do a, de a nice chunk of time. If I can survive it, of course. Because I don't really know. I'm assuming this would be like on a normal difficulty or something like that. And maybe it gets worse over time. Hello, South Sal. Or I'm sorry, you're Cow Cow in this game. That's right. Yeah! So, this is pretty much... Uh, much... In my opinion, Dynasty Warriors 2, although good and challenging, this game pretty much made it to where it was so much cleaner in my opinion this game is pretty much a just a much more like oh, cleaner version of dynasty warriors 2 and there's also more move sets to it as well so before it was just that that was the move set that they had in dynasty warriors 2 for Zhao Yun. man you know chill out also you gotta work with the camera in this game when i first got this game i spent so much time on it and it really sucks that I'll have to do it again. Because don't get me wrong, I love this game, but it really sucks when you go through like crazy grinds and everything, and then you have to restart it all because you lose a memory card. For those of you who are uh, in your like Xbox 360 or Xbox One days, or PS2 and PS, or I'm sorry, PS3 and PS4 days, you wouldn't understand this gripe that we're all having right now. Because me personally, man, I was about to beat his ass too. Look at that. Look at these guys. This is when I felt like Dynasty Warriors was really, really, like, challenging in a fun way. Like, there could be fun challenges and stuff in, like, Dynasty Warriors 8, Dynasty Warriors 9, sometimes. But other times, it just feels like they really, they, they really made it a little more challenging in these games. And I'm actually perfectly okay with that. I prefer these kind of more challenging Dynasty Warriors. But I think eventually these guys will come back. If not, that's it's going to be a short video, I'll tell you. Granted, if I end up living through this whole thing. This is just an endurance thing. Because even though I'm practically a veteran of Dynasty Warriors at this point, it's been a hot minute since I played this game. Oh, there's Shao Yuan with, uh... Without his weapon. Without his, uh, bone rod. Or even the twin rods. Why they gave him that, I have no clue. Yeah, this is what the game looked like beforehand, and it's it, it it definitely, honestly, I still love this this version of it to death. This was what introduced me into Dynasty Warriors and Koei, pretty much in general. Come here, where y'all going? Where y'all going? Come here, come here. Because I ended up getting it on the jam pack, so this is where it all began for me. But, I ended. I didn't get the full version of the game. I ended up getting. I ended up getting. And good lord, does it look like dog crap right now? Because I'm playing this off an actual PS2, and it looks like crap. But um, it definitely looks. It would definitely look better on like something else. But I'm playing this on my PS2, and man, this is the thing. All right. Oh, good. Lou Boost here. That's gonna be fun. Oh, I got him off the horse, though. Now, let's see if I can... Oh, he he, he he can't take a hit. He's fine. Yeah, he, he did. 
And I don't think, don't get me wrong on this, Lubu was actually really challenging in this game as well. I think the most challenging I ever found him to be was in Dynasty Warriors 4. Dynasty Warriors 4 Lubu was a complete demon. This this Lubu is still strong. Yep, so they keep they keep coming back. I think they had one where, like, I think it was time attack. It was either to get a thousand kills or just plain 100. Now, for people who have played only the newer Dynasty Warriors, like, easy. Look at, like, normally people by now would be close to, like, probably around 500, 600. There weren't, there's not a lot of enemies uh, that they had in this game. And honestly, thank God they didn't, because you'd probably get completely bodied by just foot soldiers. Because foot soldiers can stagger you and everything. They can do good damage to you, unlike just officers. So this was actually way more challenging than Dynasty Warriors 9 was, I'll tell you now. I'm really glad that they had this challenge mode because, like I said, I didn't have anything because memory cards. But I just, I love, I honestly miss this old moveset of Zhao Yun's. I love it to death. Zhao Yun back in the day. I mean, look at this armor, too. This design is, like, really, really dope as well. I really enjoyed this armor. It was a really good design. So this is when everything was nice, simple, still kick ass and everything. For this one, it was like you against hundreds. In Dynasty Warriors like nine and eight, it was like you against thousands. And but the thing is, uh, the 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 challenge that these foot soldiers gave in this game was completely different from nine. Like nine and eight, they'll just sit there and take it, and then just die in like two shots. With these soldiers. I know it's not really showing too much right now because, of, like I said, I'm I'm a veteran of this game. But if you're like someone who just hops into this game, you'll know that there's a significant difference with these uh, foot soldiers. So I guess this won't be super long of a video because I might just circle, uh, not go all the way around again, but like maybe go like halfway. Yeah, <gasps> chain with the dual maces. Hiya, hiya. So until I end up getting. Uh, more motivation to do the entire game again of Dynasty Warriors 3. I think I'll just come back to the uh, challenge mode area for this game. And if that ends up being the same in Dynasty Warriors 4, which I think I have at least some safe data on that one, um, I'll just go to their challenge modes or something. So you guys can see everything. I think they have challenge modes. I'm not sure. If anything, I could just go to like Dynasty Warriors 4 Empires. Oh, we got Suit Say now. Oh, look, the Tonfas. Yeah! Yeah! Ah! Ah! Also, I guess, in a way, it's probably not looking super well because it's in widescreen. I was thinking of just doing another layout, but I just decided to just prop out the black area and then just make it so the, it was, like, completely full screened and everything. Let me check something real quick. Oh, okay. There we go. Perfect. I think it was get to a thousand kills in one of them. Like now, like nowadays, that's that's easy. Like as you can see, it's pretty time-consuming to get to that point in this one. And it's not the goal. It's not to hit a thousand or anything. It's uh, just just try to survive as best you can. That's literally the goal. Ow! I was waiting for Guan Yu to try to attack me. Like like nope, I can't do it. Never mind. There we go. Like, you gotta be pretty careful with your stuff here, because these guys can... Like, even the foot soldiers can start staggering you and mess up your combos and everything. Thanks for the help, one. You Ow, 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 bastard! So... Oh, so it's just pause. Okay. Wait, what? Top score, 1,000. Okay. Also, you, when you're when you're kind of, like, attacking someone, you can't really turn around. So you're gonna have to stop mid-combo for this. I don't know if they ended up fixing that in 8, or not 8, I'm sorry. They ended up fixing that in uh, 4 or 5, but it's a thing, all right. Yeah? But man, I this brings back so many memories. I miss this game. I miss a lot of the old Dynasty Wars, but we're going to be going up to my favorite one very soon. And I can't wait for that. There's 4. Oh my god, that thing is beautiful. I love 4. 
Oh, whoops. Thought he was closer than that. Maybe we will be able to make another lap around. I don't know. We'll see. I'll, I'll see what happens with, with the time, because I don't want this to drag on too long. Because this actually is really perfect, this challenge mode, because one, it gives them like their weapons right off the bat. Oh, hello again, Sao Sao. Oh, I'm sorry, Cow Cow. You're Cow Cow now. Oh, this man lives. Crazy. What's he giving me? Arrows, thanks. And I can't say this bodyguard system was my favorite in particular. It was actually three extreme legends. Uh, bodyguard system was that was my favorite. I loved the bodyguard system in that game. I like how this actually also does tell me like how long I've been fighting so far. Ow, bastard! And yeah, I think only the officers give me items. I think so. If I need to heal. Like, this is just... Th all this damage is just from Foot Soldiers. So I'm telling you, like... I mean, Foot Soldiers can do damage to you, but half the time in newer games, they aren't even really fighting you. They're just sitting there taking it. Like, this was... This was good stuff back in the day. They The, the peons felt like warriors. It took some effort to actually kill some of them. Yeah, I think we'll do... I think we'll finish this lap and then... Uh, we'll call it. We'll head over to the uh, we'll head over to the gate and then call it. All right, hopefully Shaho Yuan can give me some heals or it's maybe shorter than I thought. Ow. Okay. Yep. Yep. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, meat bun. I'll take it. Actually, I forgot how much meat like a regular old meat bun can do for you. So I don't think there's pairing in this game or anything. I think that's in four. Four or five, I think. They had they like gave us parrying. I think it's four. They also had a cool taunt system that could like break people's guards. It's pretty dope. I'm telling you, man, if you haven't played Dynasty Warriors 4 at least, that's a good place to to start. Because Dynasty Warriors 4 is amazing. I love it to death. Four and Extreme Legends together is even better. You can put both the games together and everything. Unfortunately, I couldn't do that for this game because I don't have Extreme Legends, even though Extreme Legends is one of my absolute favorite things. And uh, this will keep going on. This will definitely keep going on because of uh, my Imperial Seal item. The Imperial Seals, for those of you who are uneducated in this game, the Imperial Seals will give you 10 seconds worth of Muso. So it'll be infinite for 10 seconds, which is awesome. Stop. Hiya. But yeah, if, if, honestly, I was going to be hesitant to do this video if they didn't have like a challenge mode or anything. I was looking versus, but I was like, oh wait, you can't do that with AI. So I ended up just, I ended up seeing challenge mode. I was like, oh yes, because challenge mode gives you uh, their weapon, which is perfect. Their best weapon, not not level four weapon, but like the weapon that has all the moves. All right, come here, Lupu. Got a lock. Damn, I got thrusted by freaking private. What? Why is Guan Yu here? What? Hang on. Why? I was not anticipating a two-on-one attack. Ah, the wielders of the red hair. Or the uh, masters of the red hair. Oh my god. Also, yeah, they had true Muso attacks, which uh, did that. Oh, Lubu's going to beat the crap out of me now. He's like, I heard you were talking shit last time. I was going to be... Oh! <laughs> I may not make it. Yeah. Oh, Guan Yu's down. Take the meat bun. Oh! Also, um, the reason why I got scared there is because the neutral triangles, these... Ow, ow, ow. The neutral... No. The neutral triangles actually um, break your guard. So he could have done something to me once he did that. Oh, I can't turn around. 
I'm telling you, once you start attacking, you, you need to be careful because you won't be able to stop. You'll be locked onto that like that one person. It's like working with the flame bow in Dynasty Warriors 8. Except this way, this person's still more fun to me. Alright, so... Yeah, let's clear this area out, then we'll call it a video. So I gotta say, this is fun. This, this game... Oh, ugh. Okay. That's right, I forgot there's dazing in this game. Like, they can daze you and everything. Make you dazzy. Because this move... Hip. Ow, ow. This move... If it doesn't kill. This move... Freaking... Like, look at this, man. Foot soldiers do a lot of damage. Like, they... They don't... They don't mess around in this game. The foot soldiers will hurt you. They will... They will... Plug your ass with their swords. Seems to be... Oh. I'm about to die just from the soldier. I think they're also getting harder as they respawn. I think. I'm not... I'm probably not 100% on Or 100% right, excuse me. That I'm just getting worse and worse as time goes on. Alright, and this will clear them. Ow! Man, get your ass out of here. Oh. Man. Oh. Okay. You live. Okay, there we go. Alright, guys, so this will be the end of this video for Dynasty Warriors 3's Zhao Yun. This, was the e this is the evolution of Zhao Yun. This is an evolution of the warrior, I should say. This is a new series that I ended up mentioning, and this is... Uh, we've already done a first part with uh for those of you who are new we already did a part one with uh dynasty warriors 2 Zhao Yun because we're not we're skipping dynasty warriors 1 because this is where the warriors games actually like really started kicking off and everything so that's why we're doing it starting with two and there will be dynasty warriors 2 version at the uh end screen annotations and as well we will be doing dynasty warriors 4 on the same week so it's gonna be a pretty busy week for uploads on me so i hope you guys are ready for that because thanks to the dynasty warriors 9 dlc because i didn't want to be too far behind in it we're doing that, so we're probably going to be getting a couple double uploads there. But, alright guys, this is Dynasty Warriors 3, Zhao Yun. Now it's time to go hop into the best Dynasty Warriors, Dynasty Warriors 4. So, hope you all look forward to that. If you all are enjoying this series, be sure to hit that like button. It really lets me know that I need to keep continuing this. And I'll be sure to do it with other warriors from, like, Dynasty or Samurai. And, be sure to hit that subscribe button, because we are trying to hit 500 before summer. So be sure to do that if you haven't already. For those of you who have, we have broken the 400 barrier, and I can't thank you guys enough for it. With all that being said, thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Farewell.